drive became a practical drilling machine in 1982 when rotating the drill string by means of a motor on torque reaction rails in the derrick began setting records drilling for Adnock in the Umshe field in the Arabian Gulf. Power swivels had been employed for years on workover rigs, but these were lightweight hydraulic motors that were not capable of drilling. Over the next 20 years, the electric top drive became the standard of the industry, setting new drilling records and permitting new technologies that allowed us to reach and produce new drilling horizons. Top drive allowed us to drill with 90-foot stands, keeping the bit on bottom longer and producing more consistent directional control over longer intervals. Top drive has allowed us to recover longer core samples, back ream out of trouble spots, and generally produce a smoother, more consistent borehole in less time than conventional rotary drilling. But with new technology came new challenges. The standard DC traction motor required a gearbox to match the speed and torque requirements of drilling to the output of the available motors. Simply boring out the shaft of a conventional motor created a potential for washout and intrusion of drilling fluid into the motor under load. Not an attractive prospect. Suspending a gearbox below the motor required a number of bearings, seals, lubrication pumps, and plumbing to contain a direct lubricant to critical components. As it turned out, these items were failure prone, and the top drive suffered from gearbox problems. In practice, some 60% of drilling downtime today is due to the conventional top drive. Of that figure, 40% is due to gearbox failure. That's a significant figure, but one that could be greatly improved. Laterno Technologies Incorporated, a new company with decades of experience in drilling, construction, electrical power, heavy machinery, and manufacturing through its Laterno, OEM, and Rowan components began an investigation of the top drive and after 20 years experience with the product, how it could be significantly improved. It was time for a new generation of top drive. First was a review of the weaknesses of the gearbox. LTI's goal was to eliminate the gearbox altogether, and eliminating the gear train, shafts, bearings, seals, and lubrication system that were the source of critical and expensive failures. At the same time, new AC drive technologies had replaced the old DC traction motor with a much more powerful, reliable, and economical machine. LTI turned to its sister company for a state-of-the-art AC drilling motor specifically designed for top drive applications. By varying the current and frequency of the power applied to an AC motor, we can control speed and torque with precision. The AC motor is capable of far higher torque and speed without the need of a gearbox. With both higher peak torque and higher continuous torque and higher usable speed than a typical DC motor of similar size. With this speed, torque, and control advantage, LTI began to investigate the possibility of eliminating the gearbox. With its partner OEM, the leading manufacturer of specialty high-performance AC motors, LTI rethought the top drive's drivetrain. Providing a full-bore shaft to permit flow of drilling fluid through the drill string would require a full-size drilling shaft, around which a concentric motor shaft could be fitted and a high-density armature assembled and wound to fit this large shaft, rather than squeezing all of this into a bored-out standard motor shaft. That's the difference in the LTI drilling motor. It is a proprietary, purpose-built electrical machine that is built around a full-size, full-capacity drilling shaft within it, rather than a thin, hollow shaft into a standard armature to drive the drill string, or a larger parallel shaft driven through a gearbox by a motor or motors mounted alongside. This is a powerful AC machine that eliminates the gearbox and all of the associated maintenance and failure potential of a high-torque gear reduction unit working overhead in the derrick. But eliminating the gearbox was only one of the design criteria for this next generation top drive that LTI designated the direct drive. Isolation of the mud system from the motor, improved cooling, 
more rugged windings, bearings, and seals would be key goals of the drilling assembly. Pipe handling by means of a fully adjustable hydraulic link tilt and rotating head positions and extends the elevators to the racking board or the mouse hole, making tripping and connections easier and safer. A full hydraulic counterbalance allows the sub pin to engage the box threads and make up without binding. On disengagement, coming out of the hole, it allows the pin to jump the box without shoulder damage to the connection. Inside dual BOPs provide the ability to disconnect the drilling assembly from the drill pipe while leaving a closed valve on top of the string, allowing safe connection of suitcase bales and powerful pumps to dominate well pressure and pump down heavy mud. Well control procedures using the direct drive are identical to those developed for any dual IBOP system. A hydraulically operated upper IBOP can be opened or closed to control mud flow during connections or to shut in the drill pipe at any position in the derrick. The LTI direct drive is an extremely flexible machine. Designed for installation on new rigs for land or offshore service, but it is easily adapted to existing rigs, particularly as a replacement for a conventional top drive equipped rig. Direct drive can be fit on the existing top drive rails in the derrick to minimize the cost of upgrading most existing rigs to the latest drilling technology. Installation of the direct drive in a derrick or mast requires a set of torque reaction rails, a junction box above the fingerboard in the derrick, electrical, hydraulic, and instrumentation connections from the floor to the box, a single service loop to carry power, hydraulic pressure, and return lines, and instrumentation and control lines on the drilling machine. Drilling fluid from an existing top drive standpipe or from an extended rotary drilling standpipe connects through a standard top drive mud hose. In new installations, rails are secured in the derrick from below the crown to about 12 feet above the floor. These rails, in one of the latest compact wool slayer derricks, can actually be laid down and moved with the direct drive in position, saving hours of labor in laying down and picking up the drilling machine. AC motor controls are located in an electrical bay along with other motor controls for draw works, rotary table, and pumps. Here the electronics that monitor and control the performance of the direct drive are housed in a climate controlled space. Here also is where the routine tests and data checks are performed that help ensure consistent performance of the system. In the rig's control cab, the direct drive is operated by the conventional rig control system, brake, throttle, and assignment switches. For the drilling crew accustomed to top drive drilling, the training required for the direct drive is completely transparent. A number of maintenance checks are eliminated, mostly those associated with the gearbox and pneumatic system, that are no longer a part of this machine. Otherwise, regular maintenance checks are similar. In operation, the direct drive gives all the advantages of the conventional top drive, whether drilling ahead, back reaming, or drilling with mud motors. When making connections, the system makes and breaks connections using the fully controllable torque capabilities of the AC motor. Making up connections of stands or singles from the mouse hole to the proper torque before running in the hole. Tripping requires exactly the same operation as a conventional top drive pulling out stands, racking them back with the assistance of the hydraulic link tilt, and running in the hole with ease and consistency. Lower maintenance, a full range of torque and hook load capacities, adapt easily to any drilling application. From a 250 ton, 21,000 foot pound continuous torque capacity machine, and units with 350, 500, 750 and 1,000 ton capacities with up to 95,000 foot-pounds continuous torque rating are available with more to come. LTI offers a selection of direct drive drilling machines to fit your applications. For a better way to drill, go direct with direct drive from LTI.